say See you later If I thought I'd see you later Take ten. I think so. Okay. It is. It's hard being in front of the camera, though. So yes. Like, <laughs> I'm super used to just being behind it, and it fucks me so much. Mm -hmm. If I'm being honest. Mm -hmm. okay. I feel like I'm doing that like Vogue interview right now. Yeah. Like, the questions with Vogue. <laughs> All right. Hi, I'm Ella Torres. I'm the design editor for the CI View. I really love working with the View and the team. I was definitely nervous stepping into the job. Um, fairly inexperienced, I think, in the world of journalism, and everyone just had really welcoming arms. I think watching Alan freestyle rap. <laughs> definitely, definitely was very entertaining. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think we've talked about it before, but producing a song and a music video to match it, and like trademarking it. That, that'd be pretty cool, having like a little CIV intro. I think there's like the obvious answer. I, I really miss everybody, but more into that, I think these are connections that are lasting, gonna last a lot longer than just in the office. And I'm excited to go see um, Ryan perform in her band and you know, make it big. And. I'm excited to see Alan and I'm not Alan, <laughs> Aileen in the theater and you know Alan's films and Ash's videos. Um excited to, you know, get probably hospitalized and see Miriam. That'd be really fun. Um but yeah, I'm just I'm just looking forward to um, continuing these relationships. Yeah, just How's my hair? Look good. Pretty good. What if I keep on distracting you guys? Um, my experience working at the CIVU has truly been a very incredible one, I'd say, with a lot of growth. Obviously, it wasn't smooth sailing the entire time, but with the help of the team at the CIVU and the leader, Annie, I really was able to kind of grow out of really bad old habits and just I don't know thrive here and I think a lot of it is not due to me but due to the people here oh I love them I think the people I work with are like my family now which you know makes for an interesting work dynamic for sure but I wouldn't have it any other way oh gosh um Oh my god, there are so many. I will say any time Kurt opens his mouth is just so funny that it's always a highlight. Um, or Miriam's dinner party where just so much happened in such a short span of time. Um, but I also have to say there was this one weekly where we were all kind of just at our end and so tired but we were pushing through it and Alan and I just laid on the floor and we're just like, we got this. We laid on the floor for like five minutes, talked about life and philosophy, and then got up and got the weekly out. Tell us about your experience working here. I couldn't tell you. I don't work here. Um, I work at the Latinx Cultural Center. Um, honestly, it's been such a great experience. Got to make a lot of connections with a lot of people I would have never met without being here. And it's just been a great time and just love every moment of it. So my experience working here at DCIVU has definitely um, evolved just from becoming an intern to finally being like having a position within the organization. 
I feel like I've been able to really expand my skill set from video editing to also being able to interact with people. I used to struggle a lot with like interacting with people, communicating with them at an eye level, and just having like this wonderful team that I can probably say that they're like my family. I have allowed myself to not only collaborate with them, but also get to know them like person to person and just being able to interact with them within work and outside of work, which is really cool. My favorite experience so far is actually outside of work. So um, we got to have dinner at one of my coworkers' house and that was really cool just to be able to experience and be like normal people. And we don't have to worry about like about work or like just stress about anything. It's been one of my favorite jobs so far. I've never had a job like this where I've been able to actually get close to my coworkers, do something that I love to do, and I don't know, it's just been really fun. I really, I really like it. Being able to be on a team where everyone is being creative, everyone has ideas, it made it so much easier to actually think and actually perform and do things. So I, but yeah, it wasn't really that big of a challenge, but we definitely, it was hard for me at first. We ended up killing it though. Uh, my experience working here was pretty awesome. Um, I was the managing editor and I really liked my team. Um, I really liked editing, writing, all that kind of stuff. It really taught me um, a, a different way to write and a different way to interview people. One challenge I had here was learning how to work with people. Um, I, I'm kind of an introvert, so learning how to interview people and, and work with people um, was difficult for me. Um, it just came with practice, you know, I just had to keep interviewing people, keep talking to people, keep reaching out. Um, awesome, I love my coworkers. Um, I'm hoping we'll still be friends after we don't all work together. Um, everyone here is so nice and cool. That's hilarious, okay. Hi. Guys, we're gonna start recording now, okay? So be sorry. quiet, do we close this? Oh no, 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 we don't. Oh no, sorry. we don't, there's a light, so <laughs> sorry about oh, that. Oh, it's actually dead. Oh, what? oh no, no, it it's is. A, it's good to go. Even give me a halo. It is giving you a halo. Hey, perfect. Um, my experience working at the CIVU was um, pretty amazing. My favorite moments are always the Fridays when we're all in the office together and we're all talking and laughing and getting to know each other. Um, I think we had like a little end of the semester party at the end of our fall semester. And I loved it preparing for it because I was thinking about how much I love everyone on this team and like how I wanted everything to be so good for them and I was um, really looking forward to this opportunity to all just sit together and to eat together and to um, and to just um, be together and I don't know just love each other that's what I loved oh I hadn't really thought about this yet okay if I I am leaving, um, graduating in just less than a month, and I think if I could say anything to this particular group of people is that um, you are each so very talented and very powerful, and to continue using that talent and that power to go out and do some good things in this world. That's a cut. Okay. Thank you, Miriam.